Yeah, yeah. yeah we're just very disappointed at the moment, yeah. Good self-inflicted brownie or not? Yeah, I'd say so, Bass. That, um, the NRL said that they were going to start sin binning players. Did you think that was a sin bin offence, mate? Um, look, everyone can make their judgment there, Crawls, but at the end of the day, they said they were going to do it and they've done it, so they're stuck with what they said. Mm. Yeah, so it's not a great deal I can come out and say against it, Yeah, you know? It's a part of the game they want to eradicate, which is fair enough. Presumably all the players are aware of that? Oh, you wouldn't have seen us do that, a late hit on anyone for, on kickers. We've always taught them to grab and bump. You started well, but... The, the... They just they didn't stop, did they? Which they didn't no. against the Sharks either. That's the that's what they do. Mate, we were a bit down on energy. Truth be told, we'll touch off with our energy. Um, our kicking game was horrible. And, you know, probably had them covered still. And then they got a, far, a try from our kick, where they went the length of the field from our kick. And they got two and we had 12. So, yeah, we just imploded on ourselves. And, yeah, it's disappointing. It's probably the lesson you can get, though, isn't it, mate? You can, if you're going to take something out of it, you know that every game, I suppose, you already know that. Mate, yeah. It's yeah. So close. I was, you know, this was always going to be a tough game for us. You know, we've had huge amounts of changes and with our squad over the past five weeks with injuries and suspensions and um, people changing position all the time. With Kurt and Connor all these weeks playing different positions. So, you know, we just wanted to, I was just hopeful of was grinding out a win, to be honest with you, and then get back on the horse and start getting a bit of cohesion again in the back bit of the year. But, you know, when your energy levels are down a touch, you know, Canterbury always play with good energy. And, you know, our attack was, you know, not where it needed to be. You know, people not, their attention to detail wasn't as good as it has been this year. Brandon, when you're looking to grind out a win and you're up 6-0 and you don't take two shots at goal in, in kicking distance in the first half, is that, is that um, what you would have been looking for? Or? I'll take response to that. It was quite open and, you know, there was plenty of field there and I, I thought we could, yeah, I felt, you know, the way we were sort of, we were creating some room and we just didn't finish those sets well at the end of them, yeah, so I've got to take responsibility for that. We generally do take the two most of the time, but at 6-0 it was, you know, I felt the game was actually reasonably open, even there wasn't many tries, it was quite open, I felt we could, if we could nail one it would have been good, but as I said, you know, we didn't finish them, finish the sets off very well and um, when we had 12 men we handled that terribly. You know, we had kick out in the full era, bad kick. Just kept putting ourselves under pressure, you know. What's uh, Kalen's chances of playing next week, reckon, mate? He'd be highly likely. He finished up his rehab today and he'll start training fully with the team on Monday. That'll be a boost for everyone? Yeah, it'd be good, you know, get Kalen back and I think a Barney suspension's done, he gets to come back too, which will obviously add a bit more stability to the team and both those guys have a big impact for us. What about taking all your origin guys into the game, Freddie? It's all very well in hindsight, I guess, but you talk about lack of energy. Does that contribute to that or not? Uh, look, I, you know, when I say we're lacking energy, we weren't. You know, it's not like we weren't a long way there. And as I said, we did. We seemed like we had them covered at eight nil, and they got the fast start try from our kick. You know, went the length of the field on us. You know, those things happen sometimes. And then, you know, we seemed to be defending them and covering them, but. As I said, the, the sin binning was crucial on us. You know, and then the way we handled the sin binning, you know, if we could have got away with one try in the sin binning, who knows what may happen, but we just handled that period of the game poor. So that was Kurt Mann? Um, yeah, he had to get a few needles, Kurt, so he got, he was busted, but he got back out there. He was a tough kid, yeah. Sternum? Or? Yeah. So he might be unlikely for next week? Oh, I couldn't tell you, Baz, to be honest, yeah. I couldn't tell you, but he was d good when he went back out in the middle for us. He gave us plenty of energy and worked hard. Okay.